Loosen the bearing pedestals. Move the bearing pedestals to the proper position. Do the same operation on the other side. Connect the sensor line to the balancer one by one. As shown on the screen, install the belt. Drag the belt to check the rotation of the roller. Adjust the bearing pedestals to the proper position for placing the workpiece. Place the workpiece. Continue adjusting the bearing pedestals to the proper position. Loosen the nut on the end stop. Adjust the end stop to the proper position to prevent the left and right movement of the workpiece in the rotation process. Fasten the screw nut. Lock the bearing pedestals. Drag the belt to see if the belt can drive the workpiece. If the workpiece does not move, move the roller position. Operate as shown on the screen. Check if the belt can drive the workpiece again. Attach reflective paper to the workpiece. The attached position is set as 0 degrees. Adjust the sensor angle and position. Infrared rays need to be irradiated to the reflective paper on the workpiece. Lock the knob. Plug in the power cord. Place the notch of the power cable facing up. Operate as shown on the screen. Turn on the main power switch. Enter the electronic measuring system. Wait for the signal light to finish flashing. As shown on the screen, Chinese and English can be switched through the drop-down option. Click user login. Enter password. Click OK. Click login. When infrared rays irradiates on the reflective paper, the indicator light is on. When the infrared ray shines on the position outside the reflective paper, the indicator should light off. Operate as shown on the screen. Rotate the workpiece gently. At this point, the infrared ray shines on the position outside the reflective paper. However, the orange indicator light on the sensor is still on. This shows that the sensor sensitivity is too strong and needs to be weakened. Turn the knob slowly in a counterclockwise direction until the orange indicator light goes off. Operate as shown on the screen. At this point, gently rotate the workpiece back and forth. Check whether the infrared ray still lights up when the reflective paper is illuminated. Rotate the workpiece for one circle to see if there are any other reflective points on the workpiece besides the reflective paper. The sensitivity of the photoelectric sensor needs to be readjusted if there are other. Loosen the nut fixing the bearing pedestals. Operate as shown on the screen. Do the same operation on the other side. Operate as shown on the screen.